I always found it pretty funny that whenever there was an advertisement for medicine or whatever, they'd always show some really happy footage while they just listed all the dangerous side effects like Touching grass is a once-a-day medicine to improve socialization skills for gamers when used alongside a healthy diet and exercise. Stop touching grass and call your doctor right away to lower your dosage if you experience side effects such as breakdown in hives, severe stomach pain, itching, trouble breathing, diarrhea, and even death. These side effects may appear for those who have severe social skill issues. The TacFit company is not responsible for any deaths. So good luck out there gamers. Okay, YouTube has just been like showcasing to me that stupid Alaska Airlines fly ad to me before like any single video starts for like the past few months now. And I am almost on my limits, all right? I'm actively searching for an ad blocker on my phone because I just hate seeing that ad every single time. I don't know what it is that, about that ad that like irks me so much. Maybe, maybe it's like the stupid Care Bear that like sings its song. Maybe it's like their slogan right afterwards. And it's just like, bro, I just hate it so much, all right? Their slogan is, is something like, we care a lot. And it's just, I'm sitting here on my chair like we do not care like at all all right i cannot care less about this youtube my phone i know that you guys are like spying on me so that you guys can like recommend me some content to like make me stay on your guys website for much longer i don't even know what i'm saying anymore maybe i've gone like, crazy and it's just like okay if you guys are gonna like spy on me to like recommend it, recommend me some stuff okay give me some ads that I, I would like actually watch which are like none of them all right i don't want to watch any ads so don't give me ads at all. Just give me YouTube premium for free because you should listen to me. Why? I don't really know. Maybe if I ask, it's just like really, really nicely. Pretty please, YouTube. Maybe. I thought the Care Bear Alaska Airlines fly ad was like bad enough. But then, okay. There are also like these Twitch ads now where it's just like, where it's just like places companies whatever i don't know pizza in particular they've been like they've been like trying to like relate to the gamers so there's just like this one pizza ad i've been seeing where it's just like someone's eating pizza but then there's like game noises and it's just like the weirdest ads i've ever seen because you know they're just like hmm, how can we relate to the, like these hip young people did that not go off okay there we go and it's just like, hmm, how exactly can we like relate to these young people? I've got it. We'll put a young person on there. We'll just put it on some like, I don't know, like some old video games, like some retro video game sound. There we go. We're hip. We're young. We've got it. And it's just, I didn't think it could get like, okay. I thought we'd like stop that kind of trend at like the, the like the. And it is just like it is so hilarious to see because i thought like companies have like stopped trying to be like quirky and relatable to their younger audience by like putting memes or whatever into the videos especially after like that i think 2016 was when the ad came out i don't i'm not sure if you guys know it but it's like that anti-smoker ad where it's called like it's a trap and then they just become like the personification of like 2010 with the amount of memes that they were like putting in and it, it is just so hilarious to see because <laughs> Because, okay, who knows? Maybe I'm being stupid. Maybe I'm being wrong. Maybe a teenage smoker that started smoking to look cool did actually stop smoking because a talking unicorn head told him that it wasn't cool to do so. All right. Maybe I'm being wrong. Maybe I don't know like the actual statistics. <laughs> but <laughs> it is just so funny to see, like look back on that video and just see like how they were like trying to like relate to their audience. All right. I'll help you out, teammate. Don't worry, I'm always here for you. Except for like a while ago when I wasn't there to like help you out with that guy. But you know what, we don't- I'm just gonna cut that out of the video. Hello. Oh, you're the last guy. This game has gone by so quickly. We There you go. Okay, you just skipped that. You know what, maybe I'm being a bit too harsh on these companies. Maybe they are putting in like a ton of effort to like try and connect with the youth. But you know what, I recognize your efforts company. Okay, you know what, okay. PSA. This is a this is an alert. Don't don't do what that guy just did. All right. If you're gonna if you're gonna like jump to joy, like to try and get to the place faster. Okay. Just jump from like the side. All right. Don't jump directly. All right. Because you're humongous. But but yeah. Don't do what I did either. Don't don't just like fall into the void. But then it's just like okay. If somebody's like bridging straight on your team, just please just jump from the side okay because minecraft is just gonna be like oh hey there's like a huge body here you know what blocks don't place because why would you all right what why is there a big hole here but then it's just like okay if you're if you're on my enemy team if you're like facing up against me you can do it to your team because i would like some wins all right friendly fire please thank you 
I've also been like getting like this Amazon ad as well, where it's just like they talk about like this program at work, like their warehouse, and it's just like they talk about how the program like doubled and even like tripled their wage, and I'm just sitting here like, so you went from one dollar an hour to two to three dollars an hour. Wow, that's that's pretty incredible. How generous of Amazon. I don't know. Maybe it's like maybe it's like two dollars plus some change. You know, they got like they got like two dollars an hour plus like a single use bathroom token because. You know, that's that's like a pretty good bonus. I'd say, wow, there's just way too many people. <laughs> it's just this entire Scooby-Doo chase. You know what? I lied at the beginning, all right? If those companies kept on making like those ads to like try and be quirky and relatable with like the young people, I would totally watch those, all right? Those are like the ads I would watch. Okay, those companies are going to make like so much revenue off of one person and that one person is going to be me and me alone. All right, I would love to like keep on watching those and like try my best to like roast them. I'm hitting this guy with a pickaxe and it's just like, okay, I guess I can't do like an ad video without talking about mobile game ads because let's be honest here, 99% of the mobile game ads that you probably see are like terrible. All right, literally like the only good mobile game ads I've ever seen are like the Supercell ones. All right, and I just hope, I really, really hope that those people are like getting paid well because those ads are like made really, really well. Like everything from like the voice actors to like the art, it's just all great. And but then it's just like all the big, all like the bad ones. Like it's just like it usually has like you like saving like a princess or whatever. And it's just like oh yeah, beat up these monsters, beat up these demons, beat up these ogres or whatever. And then you like get the princess, but then you like actually download the game, and it's literally just like a puzzle game. Uh. Nailed it. Well, we've reached the point of the video where I have like absolutely zero idea as to what to talk about, so I guess I'll do some gameplay commentary. But then it's just like, okay, I I, I still suck at like gameplay commentary. I have like zero idea as to what to say. I don't get how people do it so well. But then I don't know, man. It's just like I I just like stutter so much. Well, even more than usual whenever I do gameplay commentary, and it's just bro, like I sound like I sound like a beatboxer. And if you get, if I ever have like fan meetups in the future if i like ever reach that point in my life you guys are gonna have to like go to like near a salad bar and then like steal like the salad bar spit guards because i'm just gonna be like i'm just gonna be like spitting so much just like having to like talk super fast to people or just like having to socialize in general and it's just i don't even know what, what's going on anymore oh wow you're very very low that's not gonna work okay wow that almost worked it that scared me a lot thank you I said no thank you. I said no thank you. Alright, where are these last guys? Alright, there's four other people left. I don't want to fall on people in. Can I hit you? No. There we go, finally. Oh. We. I can actually land hits now, what is this? No. There we go. We got, we got my arch nemesis, nemesis 999. I hear blocks being placed. Sounds dangerous. Oh, he's giving me some free stuff, how nice. Bow, bow, bow. There we go. Anyways, that was some Sky Battle, guys. If you guys liked it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Maybe even share it with like everyone in your family, you know, your entire family tree. Because why not? Anyways, thanks for watching.